October 24, 1945. Birth of the United Nations. The charter of the global organization takes effect nearly two months after the Japanese surrender ending World War II. 1952. Dwight Eisenhower promises to bring the Korean War to an end. The Republican candidate for president makes his pledge on the campaign trail. Only in that way could I learn how best to serve the American people in the cause of peace. I shall go to Korea. Eisenhower wins the presidential election and visits Korea over a month later. 2002. In Maryland, authorities arrest two people in connection with weeks of deadly sniper attacks in the Washington, D.C. area. They catch John Mohammed and Lee Malvo after the series of shootings kills 10 people and wounds three. Mohammed is sentenced to death in Virginia and life in prison in Maryland. Malvo gets a life sentence in both states. 2003. The supersonic Concorde makes its last transatlantic trip, concluding 27 years of commercial service. Three of the luxury passenger jets land at Heathrow Airport outside London, all arriving from New York's John F. Kennedy Airport. 2005, civil rights activist Rosa Parks dies. In 1955, Parks made a simple decision that sparked a revolution. When a white man demanded she give up her seat on a Montgomery, Alabama bus, the then 42-year-old seamstress said no. Her act of defiance earned her the title Mother of the Civil Rights Movement. Parks was 92. And 1991. Gene Roddenberry, creator of the sci-fi TV series Star Trek, dies in Santa Monica, California. He was 70. Today in History, October 24th, Carlotta Bradley, The Associated Press.